night of us sleeping in our bed and it was amazing just waking up with all of the like natural light oh and you see i got my fan right on this nice thing but um yeah just waking up with like all of the natural light and then all of our like light bedding and the bed feels so good um it's just like a whole vibe in here and it's not even nowhere near complete obviously good morning good morning So we got sourdough bread toasted, we have avocado, we have tomato, we have everything but the bagel seasoning, and we also have crushed red pepper flakes. Okay? So basically what we're going to do is we are going to put the avocado on the toast. And I just like to slice it. So basically, just lay it out like this. Ooh, that's gonna be good. Babe is hooked on this now, y'all. And then just smash, smash, smash. Then I like to go in with a light bit of seasoning then a light layer of the pepper okay then we're going to cut the tomato Ooh, you're risking it like granny like she always has to knock or something and then and, and then she just cuts it in her hair Then we go in with more seasoning on the top. Pepper. And bam, you got avocado toast. How quick is that? This is about to try it for the first time. Mm. If I don't know, I do not like tomato and guacamole. You see, everyone ends up loving it once I give it to them, so. Now he wants to try it. Like, keep it a little bit of money. There you go. Alright, first time. What? It's good. <laughs> you talking about what? <laughs> exactly. It's delicious. Give me more. For real? Please. I need one more too, please. please. So this is the bread that I use. I use sourdough bread. This is the square sourdough loaf from Aldi. So every time I go to Aldi, I buy the sourdough. I buy all of our fruits and vegetables from Aldi. Um, so the avocado, the tomatoes. This I bought from H-E-B. You can buy red crush crushed red pepper flakes from anywhere. But yeah, this is so bomb, y'all. Y'all must try it. And another way that I've tried it was with bacon on it, with everything. Um, and then I also bought, let me show y'all what I bought too. I bought this smoked salmon to try on it. We haven't tried it yet, but I need a thought out because it's been in the freezer, but. I'm gonna try this smoked salmon to put on it to see how that tastes as well. Um, so yeah, it's all different kind of ways that you can eat it. I wanna try it with the fried egg also. Mine will be with a fried egg white because I don't eat eggs like that, especially not the yolk. Um, but yeah, I wanna try it with the fried egg. I wanna try it with smoked salmon. But yeah, y'all need to give this a try because it's good. If you like avocado, if you like tomatoes. Another thing too also is some people put sriracha on it. Be very light with the sriracha though because if you have not, if you know about sriracha, you know it's very overpowering because when I had fixed this for my stepdad, he put sriracha with his and he had never had sriracha in 
His mouth was on fire, y'all. Yeah. So this is Berkeley's mattress. It is the Newton mattress. It's 100% breathable. Um, so once you take the cover off of it, it has this. This is what the inside looks like. It's a really cool material. So this is what it looks like. So I'm gonna be washing it today because she had an accident um, last night in her bed. Her head a little, uh-oh. So this part you can actually just um, use like soap and water and just literally just put this in the bathtub or the shower. And then the instructions for this part says, you can put it in the washer, but it says to zip completely before washing. So, gonna do that, zip it all up. So I'm gonna put this in the wash and then I'm gonna take this to the bath bathroom. Today. She just got these pants on because she be crawling on the floor. This is from one of my favorite little baby boutiques. It's called Kate and Quinn. And this is, I think they're um, bamboo collection. So it's like organic it's nice. bamboo. It's so soft, y'all. And as you can see, she has the little matching booties. Um, and of course, she has the matching Ron and Rose Patsy and Clip to go with it. Yeah, I just found this in the closet brand new. I was like, she need to wear yeah, this. Brand new. Oh yeah, so here's the tag. Kate. Come on. Kate yeah, Quinn. Works. Kate Quinn Bamboo Collection. Alright, so I just came from Target. And honestly, I probably should just stayed at home. First of all, we did need some of this stuff. Well, we did need all of this stuff, but dang, Target be taxing. Literally 400 and, first of all, we got, we needed some additional pillows um, because um, the purple pillows that we have, they are too soft for us. Um, they do, say that you know you can zip them up to make them more firm um, and unzip them to make them softer still they are just too soft for us so i was telling babe that i wanted to get the um purple pillows they had the grid on the inside but i did not know that they only came in one size and they do not come in the king size so i just went to target to get us some firm pillows so we ended up getting the all positions gel pillows in the king size and they feel so good. If you like a firm pillow, these, you may want to like look into these. These are the ones I got. Anything that I mentioned in this video, of course, you know, I will link it in the description box. Um, so I got two of these. I got the Casaluna Lining Pillowcase set in black to go on the pillows. Y'all, let me just tell you. I absolutely love the Casaluna line, but it is not cheap, okay? By all means, it is not restoration hardware prices. It's not powdery worn prices or anything. But for Target, it is not cheap. These two pillowcases, y'all, for the king size, they're, they're $60. $60. Like, I was on FaceTime with Babe talking to him, and I was like, I'm, I'm not about to pay $60 for these pillowcases. I'm not about to pay $60 for these pillowcases. But I ended up paying $60 for these pillowcases. But I'm just like, $60 for these two pillowcases? I was so mad because I literally, like pretty much, well all of our bedding is from the Casaluna line. Um, but I was like, I might as well just buy the entire um, 
duvet cover set again because it was only a hundred and fifty-nine, thirty-nine, something like that. And I'm like sixty dollars for just two pillowcases. Like I might as well just buy an extra duvet cover that comes with two shams. Um so yeah, sixty dollars for two of these. And they did not have the white ones. So I ended up getting black. So you know we do have the Casaluna um big ones i forgot what those are called the king gyros or something like that okay so just a linen black linen so i think it's gonna look really good and then also i bought our um duvet it is the Casaluna brand as well from Target. This is the one we got. Duck down feel. I had went to go get the Serenity candle um, for someone for a very late Christmas present because they're coming to pick up their Christmas present today. But it was actually out and I was going to get this white one to put in my guest bathroom for the aesthetics. And so this one smells so good, y'all. So the Serenity one was actually out. So I ended up getting two of the Clarity ones. One for the guest bathroom. The other one for the gift. And I also got the room spray for the guest bathroom as well. So the Clarity um, scent is grapefruit and ginger and it is to inspire reflection let's see mm, man i want to go back and get these so the room spray oh, i think it's 10 or 15 dollars <coughs> and <coughs> the candle is 25 um Man, I just freaking love the Casa Luna collection. Like, they really come hard for real. They don't come to play. And then, as far as more home stuff, I got these two. These are salad cloths, but I just wanted to mix some wood tones in my little, um, little white bowl thing um that's on my countertop so i do have my wood utensils on there so i want to just mix a warmer wood tone um so i went and got these and that's pretty much it for the home stuff i got this also for berkeley's um bathroom it's a little suction corner basket so she has all of her bath toys that's just always just left in her um tub so i'm just i just got this to put in the corner of her tub so we can actually learn how to clean up behind her so she can we can actually start teaching her how to clean up behind herself like okay mama put your toys up you know after you get done taking a bath or whatever so i got that <clears throat> we're transitioning we're going to start transitioning her completely to sippy cups Oh, she's not happy about something. <laughs> she's a very good communicator. When it's an issue, she will let you know, okay? she get that from her mama. We're going to completely start transitioning her um, to sippy cups. Because mama is 10 months, y'all. Um, we got her some more um, teething biscuits. We got her the blueberry and purple carrot ones. She absolutely loves these. Um... She's eating food now, so she um, she eats Cheerios, um, chicken, pizza, hot wings, a pickle, <laughs> whatever we eat. Berkeley's eating at this point, so she eats little finger food. So I got her some of these. This is the banana and pumpkin flavor. These are just little um, puffs, is what they call them. Then I also got her the kale and spinach flavor as well. So yeah, this is just a little good finger food. So this is really good for her to like be able to like 
be good with her coordination, you know, to pick up the food and all of that. So, um, and another thing as far as coordination for Mama is, um, I got her this. This is so cute. I don't know why. I'm just like, it's so cute. It's just um, rings to stack or whatever. Um, but this is like for coordination as well. Because I bought this because I'm like, okay, I want to see if she can like stack the rings on the thing. And also, this rocks too. So that'll be kind of like fun for her. But yeah, this is like teaching her her motor skills. So... Yeah, it says gross motor, fine motor, and thinking skill. So yeah, this is what I got for her. So this is going to conclude the Target haul. Moment of truth. We finally got this on the wall. somebody that just make every excuse in the world to not do their work huh. it hurt really what now please tell them what's the what's the issue look at the camera and tell them look <laughs> look see me look them in their eyes and tell them my stomach hurt. <laughs> Lies. Go in there and do that work. Alrighty, so I am about to fix me a bang on ice. If we do we have anything? Okay, so Charles, basically, I'm gonna put this on the 
drinking them all without putting any cold ones back in the refrigerator. So I'm about to just have to put me one on ice. So we buy these from Sam's Costco, one of those. I guess I'll try this blue one. I'm about to edit. I'm do some editing probably for an hour and then um and then we have six more weeks of cold weather. So I'm about to order me some winter clothes. And that's it. I'm tired, y'all. I'm tired. I'm trying to have my vlogs edited by the weekend because I'm usually glued to my computer on Saturdays to have the vlog posted on Sundays for y'all. And I'm trying not to do that anymore. So, yeah, look, this is what my office is looking like, y'all. A mess, a mess. And then I have, yeah. Yeah, and I actually have like my work computer in my drawer in here. So, about to edit. And yeah. Which one you want? Which one? Which one? This one? Cookies. I'm gonna look very good before I start blaming people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We might have went through the other bag already. Let me look. Oh no, girl, we got a whole nother bag. Can we bring it? Yeah. The deep freezer. Girl. This don't make no sense. Why well, we got two bags of wings in there? Two bags, full bags. This one and another full one I haven't been open. Who bought them? Me. I buy two bags every time I go grocery shopping. Twenty. We get the four pound bags. I'm gonna get the teeny tiny ones with Dallas and Charles. Please tell me how that's gonna work. <laughs> now with Berkeley with some um, six teeth too. Please tell me how I'm about to get the teeny tiny ones. Okay. Back to looking for my cookies. I'm excited though, I'm telling you y'all. Ain't Flo, she has touched down for destruction this month. She just been having me like I don't even eat sweets like that, but I am really in here like searching for my cookies. I went and got strawberry cake mix. Well, actually, let me tell y'all the story. So, we actually had this cake mix in here. I remember seeing this cake mix in here. So, I went to Target to buy Dallas some Valentine's Day stuff for school. And um, I'm like, okay, I need to get frosting. 
But I was wanting this strawberry cake so bad. I was like, okay, we brought this from the tiny house. So just to make sure that it wasn't bad, I bought another one just to be safe. So, and what took the cake, no pun intended, is there's pudding in the mix. That's why I was like, Ooh, I gotta have it. Yeah, so my cookie's gone, but since my mama making me some wings, I guess I'll be all right. But yeah, somebody ate my cookie. Somebody to go ask Dallas. But I just ate the ice cream sandwich, so probably shouldn't be eating cookies anyway. I bet Charles ate them. He probably ate my cookies. Well, he was up working until three o'clock. So he probably ate my cookies. I'm gonna text him. He had the, um, he said that he's gonna come home tonight and go to bed early. Mm -hmm. You know he can't go to bed early. He gonna come home and try to put that stuff together tonight. Mm -hmm. Watch. That's why I come home early. Baby's starting to get stuff for his um, office. Yeah, let me tell y'all. So, some of the stuff um, for his office, like, we've been trying to get stuff from Ikea for the longest. So, every time we go, the stuff is out of stock. So, he was finally able to find some stuff that was in stock, um, like some book cases or whatever, um, for his office, and then also something for the media room a console and um the stuff is always out of stock out of stock out of stock out of stock and the thing is um the boxes would not fit in my car so they were like you can order it online you have to pick it up within 24 hours so he was just like forget it i'm just gonna rent a truck so after work last night he rented a truck and he went to pick the stuff up so we have all the stuff in the garage. Um, he got some bookcases. He got something for the media room. His desk, um, he ordered from Restoration Hardware. Um, it was supposed to be here in April. I think it's pushed back into March now. So he's still just using a table for his desk. But the good thing is he'll have those boxes. Um, Kind of cleared out because he'll have like some of his bookcases put up so that's a good thing i say you ate my cookies he's talking about what cookies the ones i got from christmas i say the ones i got from christmas yeah he out of line he's his mind always be real foggy he know he got candy and did not get any cookies Mm. I cannot. Ma. <laughs> um. The cookie update. These are the cookies that was missing. So, we have these Valentine's Day cards. Okay, so Dallas, even though he's doing virtual school, his teachers, um, the way that his school is set up is really cool because they make sure to include all of their virtual classrooms with the students that are in person learning. So, Dallas, can you get your own bag that you made? They, Dallas made his Valentine's Day bag. They made them online together during like their Zoom um, session. And so what I have to do is I have to go drop it off. And so what they do is they let all the students put their Valentine's Day cards in there. And so Dallas will have to have his in his bag when I drop it off and then he'll be able to, they'll be able to distribute his cards. So this is his bag that he made. Super cute. Do you want to name your bear? Um, my bear name is Frankie. Frankie. And what kind of bear is this? Koala. Alrighty y'all, so I am at Home Good. 
what I'm in here for is I'm just looking for another one of those pillows um, that I had got from Marshalls <clears throat> that I had originally had on our bed. I currently have it in our living room right now, so I just want to see if I can find another one. So this is actually the Home Goods and the Marshalls that's combined. So I want to see if I can find that. I'm actually looking for some utensils for my kitchen. And that's it. I'm gonna go into Marshalls and see if I can find anything that catches my eye. And that's it. That's all I'm coming in here for. Nothing else, y'all. I don't plan on spending any money in here on anything else. You know, unless I just see something that I just gotta have. But. Okay, so I'm not finding any luck finding the pillow. That's really making me sad. This one is cute though. But it's definitely not for our room. I was thinking for my office somewhere. I know I'm gonna like hate myself for not getting it. I don't know. We'll just keep it in the basket and think about it. Okay, so these are the home items that I got. I got these um, Ralph Lauren pillows. Super, super cute. They're like in this natural color. Super, super cute. I think they're gonna look really good on our on our pillow, on our bed, like in this linen material. And it has the detail down here, just really clean. So I was wanting to mix like the white, the black, and then also like this beige color since we have our headboard that's beige. And they didn't have the, um, they call this color natural. The Casa Luna collection refers to this as natural. And they were actually out of this color in the pillowcases like this. So luckily the, um, these Ralph Lauren pillows um, are in this color to tie in this beigey in the headboard and also in our rug too, as you can tell. It has the variation in the, in the gray, the off-white, and then kind of that tan color. So I got two of those. These were $29.99 a piece. So I'll be styling the bed later. I was just really anxious to get them, to put them on here to see how they would look. These, these are the soap dispensers. These are so cute. They were $12.99 a piece. As I mentioned, I just wanna make sure they work. I got the last two. So these will be going in the guest bathroom. And then I got this, y'all know how I am about, oh, is this leaking? Y'all know how I am about my um, room and linen mist. So I got this one. It is room 1019. It is a calming balance surrounding all piece. Lavender and vanilla fragrance. And then, this is super cute. In one of the other vlogs I showed you guys the plastic pitcher with the matching cups that I got for, um, I was telling you guys for like, the um, cocktail mixes for like brunch and stuff. But I got this. It says that it's a biscuit jar. I have no idea what a biscuit jar is. I guess like you put like a cute napkin in it and put your biscuits in it. But what came to mind, well I guess that is kind of cute. Biscuits and gravy like this. Mm, yeah, that'll work. But what I was wanting to do is I was wanting to put fruit in here. Like a fruit salad. Like for um brunch or whatever to have like on the um patio or whatever and that's pretty much it for home stuff y'all baby sitting here really turning the theater room into a theater y'all so he went and ordered posters and frames and everything babe show him what you got i'm so sad i haven't even got to see this movie yet y'all look what he got that was a super glare, soul. Soul and Jumanji? 
yeah, yeah. So did you watch it? Those are Dallas's some of Dallas's favorite movies. So he surprised in Dallas by putting those up. So Adventures of Black Panther. Those before I start off with, I'm gonna rotate them through. Cool. Can you um get find an emo? I think they have it. Yeah. I want what other? What's my favorite movie? White chicks. No. Matilda. I'm only gonna start doing like classics. Matilda is a classic. Scarface. Matilda. You know what Matilda is, right? I don't even know. Are you so? Oh my gosh, he doesn't know what Matilda is, y'all. That's you... a witch girl. She's not a witch. She doesn't matter. Yes. We need to watch that. Okay. Anywho, um, I'm about to go put the contact paper down on Dallas's table because he is destroying it. make it make sense so that's going to determine if you should go ahead and put both of those on that wall or you should just put one on that wall so do you want black panther and adventures on the same wall yeah i kind of want black panther on the front right here and then i want avengers over there and then i want this one right here probably okay i'll just go ahead and put this over babe what? You just say you wanted something different. Don't put it up. 
No, I mean, I can change it whenever. I think I'm just going to put this right here for now. You don't like, you don't think that looks good? It's your room. I was just asking if you wanted Black Panther and Avengers on the same wall. Alrighty, so we're currently trying to hang up some curtains in the bedroom. This is what we have so far. This is not what we, what not, not what I originally had envisioned. Um, so we finally got us a rod. Um, we have just been struggling finding a rod for a bay window for the size of our bay window. Apparently we have a really huge one. So, oh, but anywho, we got some curtains. And these are really too long. And so we were gonna use like some curtain fabric. Um, but I like the drama, how they are really just like draping the floor for real. And since we have three panels gathered here, it really is like dramatic. And it really looks like, okay girl, you got money. <laughs> but these come from Ikea. But will nobody never know? Nobody would never know. Nobody would never know. But yeah, so this is what we're doing right now. So it's looking real good, y'all. It's looking real good. So I will show you guys the finished product if we finish tonight. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we don't run into any more issues with it. And once again, these are the Linda Curtains from IKEA. We have the 118 inch length in here and for this window here i think we're going to use nine panels um and then for over there we're just going to probably use two it's the hundredth day of school for dallas and <laughs> here we are okay okay turn around to the back let me see these suspenders <laughs> really Okay, that's how old people do. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, fresh with the ones though. <laughs> that's actually a flower. That's what I thought I was like, that's actually a cute outfit. <laughs> You gonna be a fly grandpa? Sure. <laughs> you gonna be like your papa, if basically. I, if, if I had some gray sketchers, <laughs> the thick ones. <laughs> oh. Alrighty, so I just left from getting my eyebrows um threaded. I'm thinking I'm gonna go. No, I'm not going to Target. I'm not going to Target. I might go to TJ Maxx. Not anything I need, but y'all, let me tell you. This is why it is so important to go to Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, whatever you gotta do to find what you're looking for. You need to go very often because the pillow that I was looking for. Why did I just find it at TJ Maxx, y'all? The pillow that I was looking for, for um, that I had on my bed, that I had moved to my couch, I thought that I was completely satisfied with how I had um, arranged it on my bed. Um, but now that I found a second one, I bought it just in case because as of right now, I am satisfied with how I arranged it because you know, I bought the Ralph Lauren pillows or whatever. Um, but just in case I bought the second one because you never know and it was the last one so I hurry up and snatch that thing up so from TJ Maxx today I'm gonna show you guys what I got um, as far as home things I got these cute wooden utensils they're very like raw looking like Look how crooked that is. So I'm just kind of collecting all different wood tones to put in here. And I got these cute coffee mugs. As I mentioned, 
to you guys. I am collecting coffee mugs for my coffee area and I'm thinking this is maybe for Black History Month because they have this one also. They also had this other really cute one that had a lid but I'm like okay. Um, I don't need too many of them. I just wanted like a couple of them. Um, so I got this one for babe and then I got this one for me. And then the reason I didn't get the other um, black one um, with the lid is because I got this cup with the lid. Um, I'm really big into drinking uh, water with the um, packs, like the green teas and all of those, like the zero calorie packs or whatever. But the thing is, I'm still using like the big jug that I got from when I was in the hospital having Berkeley, and it doesn't fit in my cup holder in my car. So I got this one and it'll fit in my car, y'all, in my cup holder in my car. And it has a handle, a lid, and a straw. So I could not pass this one up. It was 16, six, come on, $16.99. I got this black paper towel holder. I'm gonna put this in the guest bathroom. Um, I'm sick of having the paper towels just sitting on the counter. I got these chalk markers for the chalkboard wall. I'm hoping these are erasable because I had bought some chalk markers for the chalkboard that I had at my wedding and they were permanent so I was reading on here and it said it was like for dry erase a window all of that so I'm hoping that they're erasable I got this all black soap dispenser I've been on the hunt for like these everywhere I go if I see like cute soap dispensers I get them I want to be putting this one in Dallas's bathroom I got this um candle it's a sand and fog candle it's a tropical citrus um scent um and that's pretty much it and i did tell you guys that i did get the other pillow so i'm going to style it on the bed to see if i actually like it or not if not i'm going to take it back if i do then yay and i put the second pillow um on here Let's try to fix it like this. And yeah, all of that searching high and low for, hmm. So y'all really need to see the overall look, but excuse like my crap on the floor. <laughs> Anywho, this is how it's looking with the two pillows. The two, those pillows that I've been searching for. And I don't like it. I do not like it. I actually prefer it with the one. So let me show you guys. These are our curtains that we actually hung up. I never gave you guys an update about those, but those are the curtains. They literally are puddling the floor. So it does give it a really dramatic look. Um, but that's just a little too dramatic for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some fabric tape on it to tape it a little bit um but as you can see this is where these two Ralph Lauren pillows tie into the color of the curtains so it all ties in um really well actually I don't know how it's showing up on camera but it looks really good so we're gonna go back to just the one pillow all right so that's much better just the one pillow with the two solid pillows we have the king euro castellonas here we have our pillows that we actually sleep on so yeah this is how the bed is looking really cute just with the rug the curtains my shoes on the floor. Yeah.